I'm Katie Whitman. I'm the photograph conservator here at the Art Gallery of Ontario. Uh, as a photograph conservator, I am responsible for any and all works that involve photography. I work with all types of photographs. Within the Ian Baxter and exhibition, there are a number of Polaroids. Polaroids were developed in the 1970s and were made as a quick photograph, a photograph that didn't have to be sent to a developer and printed. Uh, everything is inherent in the process. What happens is the photograph is taken and then there's a pocket of chemicals built into the photograph itself. And once the photograph is taken, the image, the, the photographic surface is passed through rollers and all the chemicals are spread across the surface of the photograph, developing it within a couple of minutes. Unfortunately, there's no way of washing away the chemicals. So consequently, over the next decade, 20 years, the photographs will fade, they will crack, they will discolor. In order to prevent some of that from happening, the images are kept, are displayed under a lower light level than other works that you'll see. What I am working with right now here in the conservation lab is a 20 by 24 inch Ian Baxter and Polaroid. It's my task to make sure that the photograph can withstand being on exhibition. In this case, what I'm looking for are tears, split corners, anything that might be exacerbated by the object being on display. If you look closely, it almost looks like the, the sky area is slightly dirty. That's part of the deterioration that's going on and eventually streaks will form as, as the image deteriorates. Ian Baxterand was an interesting artist to work with. He is concerned about conservation of his work. He actually worked with us in many cases to ensure that his works would be around for the future.